pretty much a perfect away away day, Graham. Um, no, we conceded at the end. We should have kept a clean sheet. The clean sheet was there for us, and we didn't. Um, on, a, on another day, that could have hurt us. Nonetheless, though, three points at a very, very tough place to come, despite their recent troubles. Yeah, yeah, it is. Tom Mayer, obviously, with the, the size of the club and, and, and the effort they made in January as well. It's, uh, it was always going to be a big, uh, a big, uh, big challenge. I thought the boys were outstanding, uh, each and every one of them. I thought the bench had a big contribution as well. Um, and uh, it was a really, really good team performance today. And uh, we, w we want more. We want more of that. So, how, how, would you, how would you rank that in your sort of performances in your, ten of your tenure? At three points, it's a win. Um, it's, it's, it's a valuable win. It's a real good performance. And we've had a lot of good performances, which is pleasing. And I just said that to them there. The, the, the performances have been excellent since we've, uh, we've come in. Yes, give or take a half a game. The other night at Wimbledon, half a game at Crawley. Everything else has been uh, has, has been good. It's, it's been very, very positive. And I, I think that um, I think that that victory, them goals, they were in our locker. They were always there. And one thing we do, we always go. Um, I think it's that 11, 12 games now. We've, we've we, I think, go back to Carlo. I and mean, that was the last time we didn't score. So we, we always score. We always create chances, and it's just pleasing. And uh, I'm delighted for the lads. I'm delighted for the lads because uh, we've. We've been on the verge of, of, of winning games. We just couldn't couldn't get them over the line. We've lost a couple, and to come through, show that character today um, at such a tough place, as you quite rightly said, is testament to them. Testament to them. They're a great set. I keep saying that, and uh, they epitomised it today. So they had to show character when the, the corners were coming in early on. That, that's the key, isn't it? The riding that initial initial storm. Yeah, uh, we spoke about we spoke last night, um, and, and obviously before the game, we spoke about pressure. We spoke about the environment. We spoke about the noise, the crowd. Um, the, the referee, we, we, we spoke about all those factors and um, yeah, the, the, there were factors that we had to deal with, we had to, uh, we had to get over, we had to manage and uh, they are, um, when they get ahead of steam up here, they, 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 they rely very heavily on momentum and the noise comes from the stand and a lot of teams could go under um, and, and we didn't, we, we stood up to it and uh, as you quite rightly said, we, we headed everything that came in our box. And good, an important moment for Aaron who's had a frustrating um, first season at County. Um, for various reasons, he just hadn't got ahead of steam. Were you sort of looking for him moving on from that? Uh, uh, Aaron Wildig, sorry. Yeah, yeah, um, am I? Uh, um, what are you looking Sorry, it wasn't a very good question. <laughs> he's had a frustrating start to his yeah. life county. Yeah, um, he's, he's, yeah, I thought he was outstanding today, to be fair. I thought his, his contribution was very, very good. Um, he's been brilliant to have around the place. Yes, he's picked up a few little knocks and niggles and little bits and pieces. And If I had, a, if I had Aaron Wildig fit and, and, and raring to go every week, uh, I'm sure he would be, uh, he would be in our team, to be, to be honest. But uh, let's just hope it's not too late. Let's hope he can, uh, he can get a run in the team now. He can, he can get a run against behind him. And uh, we, we, we can hopefully see the best of him because uh, I think he, he would admit as well he hasn't quite hit the ground running yet at the football club. So hopefully um, it could even be like a new signing for us to be honest going forward. But yeah, I was delighted for him. I thought he was very, very good today, to be fair. And the arrival of Harry Charles he sort of will help him, won't he? That sort of, um, the sort of combinations you get in it. Yeah, Harry's, Harry's, Harry's enthusiastic, he's energetic, he runs beyond. He's picked up a couple of goals, obviously from midfield, and, and obviously Diggers has picked one up today. And it's true ball for, for Cavs. And Cavs' goal was from Cavs' initial press on the goalie. He got himself back on side, and then a, a lovely slid ball down the side with a great finish. Um, it's great that, that, that Cavs and, uh, and Charlie have scored. Um, that's what they were, were brought into the club for. So, uh, yeah, look, it, it was really, really positive. But look, let's not rest on our laurels. Let's, uh, let's go and look for more. Let's go and try and get some more points and more victories um, on, on the board. Um, for Charlie, that's all. you saw the first goal of senior football. It's fantastic, isn't it, to see that? I think it was a relief. I think he, he was coming close. He was coming close uh, as the weeks have gone on. Um, but, yeah, he, he's, he, I suppose as a striker, you get frustrated if you don't score. Um, they don't see strikers don't see the bigger picture, uh, the team uh, ethic and the, and, and the winning of games. But yeah, I think uh, you do get frustrated when you don't score. And Charlie was showing a little bit of frustration, and sometimes that creeps in. But I'm delighted he got the goal, um, as as Cav as well. And hopefully they can push on now and uh, and and really hit the ground running for the football club. Um, how do you approach the next couple of weeks? Is it just um, work? Just keep working harder, or do you give them a bit of time off before they oh, go definitely, again? Um, definitely, yeah. Yeah, and we, we need downtime. Um, it's been uh, it's been relentless uh, Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday, and, and I think it showed the other night in the first half performance at Wimbledon. You just looked at a team of, of tired, tired men, tired bodies. Um, I spent a half an hour in the changing room after the game the other night. I didn't do any press. So I, I Joe done it. 
I just had to pick the lads up, I just had to get around them, try and energise them. Um, they were flat, they were dead. Um, it's been really, really tough and it's been the same group of boys. And, and let's not forget, we come here today missing five of our, our regular starters. Um, so, so that was always going to be an uphill task. So uh, it, was, uh, it, it was a brilliant, uh, a brilliant squad, brilliant team performance today. And how are uh, Priestley and Aaron obviously regulars, how are they? Well, I, I, think they need, uh, I think they need Aaron and, and Priestley, need the time, need, need the downtime because we've asked an awful lot of them, we've pushed them. Uh, not only uh, not only games Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, but I demand a lot from them in training as well. And the intensity and the levels that we play at is um, is, is 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 quite high. So there's always going to be strains and, and, and stresses on the body. So yeah, look, we're desperate for a couple of down days. We're desperate for a couple of days off. I'm going to shut the place down just for two days um, and just try and recoup, um, recover, recoup. We've got five lads regulars who are not with us today. We've also got five or six lads if, if, if Ev Cadwaldo gets called up and Cav gets called up, that'll be six away for international duty. So there'll be very, very few bodies uh, to work with. So um, we, we'll get a couple of days into them into them this week. We'll give them some time off and then uh, we'll, we'll regroup and, and ready to go again next week. And what are Priestley and Aaron's problems? They just, just, just strains, just all by use. Yeah. Um, there's, there's nothing major, nothing serious. Um, the, 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 the body sometimes the body just shuts down, just doesn't let them go. So um, they were close. They were close. Had the game of being maybe tomorrow Sunday, and they probably would have played. Um, but it, they just couldn't recover in time for, for today. It just came it came a day or two too early. Brilliant. Top seven.